Yeesh, that was a fun one. Fun transition there. That was only, what, like seven different things happening at one time? <laughs> Jeez. Anyway, fellas, fellas, fellas. Ahoy. It's a new game. It's a whole new game. Aren't you worried he might steal something? Why would I steal something? I mean... I trust him completely. Exactly. It's just a power inverter. I beast. Tell me that he it. suffers from an exaggerated opinion of himself. What do you mean? Hmm. Those days are over. Rufus has learned a lot. Yeah, exactly. He is much more careful than before. Yeah, exactly. Anyway, it's just uh. This seems like a brutal thug to me. I'm right here, lady. Rufus, brutal. <laughs> Never. Not in the slightest. Anyways, I just got to get the hammer. Turn my whole house upside down. What? Could never happen. He's just getting a hammer. How much damage could he possibly do? Yeah, I mean, come on. Can a person really change so much? It's very simple. Once burned, twice shy. And Rufus has burned his fingers more than once. He has learned. I would <laughs> bet the house on it. Well, that's good, because that seems to be how it's going to go, huh? Um, tablecloth might be able to smother this. Can you promise me that he won't try to knock me out with a blunt instrument to steal my things? <laughs> Probably not. Not Rufus. When I met him, he may have been a bit crude and sometimes even disrespectful. But at heart, what? he's a very good boy. Disrespectful? Impossible. That reminds me, though. Hold up. Because of the complete lack of um, background noise, I'm not when I met. But at heart, I would much rather hear the uh, you know, the uh, sound of um. Eesh. Did he even wash his hands? Why do you of mean wash? <laughs> Rufus is very clean. That's good. I have a very limited supply of water. Oh. Well, all I'm saying is that he seems very clumsy. I don't know what you're talking about, lady. Your fears are completely groundless. Rufus has become very careful since his last adventure. Yeah, exactly. What if he suddenly blows a fuse? It's impossible. Believe me, just those happen. days are over. Yeah, what he said. Anyways, what? Uh, hum. And if he has to use the toilet, then he can do that on the trawler. What? Of course, Grandma. It's just that I have hardly any water left. He's just getting a hammer. Yeah, I'm just getting a hammer. That's all I'm getting, a hammer. Or I would be getting a hammer. It'd be good if you had any amount of water left, though. That would be nice. I know. Hmm. If that's all true, then he must have turned himself around 180 degrees. Yes, yes, absolutely. That's how it is. As if someone installed a power inverter in him. Yes, exactly. Power inverted. There we go. And he shouldn't give John Thomas too much to drink under any circumstances. Not at all. Would never happen. Well, if that's all you're worried about. Something like that can kill a little bird. Rufus isn't going to drown your bird by accident. Yeah, it'll be entirely on purpose. I mean, um, never mind. Sure, he knows what he's doing. Of course, I do. To me, as though he's too stupid to push a button. Appearances are deceiving. 
Rufus is a tinkerer like me. Yeah, exactly. Perfectly familiar with every type of machine. He would ask before he used my water supply, wouldn't he? Um, maybe. Absolutely. Good. Good. I have to get by on what I have until the end of the month. How about that? Anyways. You almost have me convinced. Only almost? Jeez, what else do you need to hear, lady? Still worries me. He had better not clog my garbage disposal. The blades are so sharp. Things are always getting caught in there. Um. Oh, Grandma. You worry about the silliest things. Yeah, that, that would not happen. Perhaps I'm worrying unnecessarily. After all, John Thomas is very good at self-defense. Wow. Oh, that bird. Oots. As if that would be at all necessary. He's very good at self-defense. Anyways. If you promise me that he will be careful, then everything is all right. Absolutely. Just as long as nothing happens to my John Thomas. I am the most careful man alive. Promise. Exactly. Hmm. Then I should apologize. I suppose your Rufus really must have improved. 100%. See, I'm putting out this fire right now. This could have burned your entire house down. Well, what do you know? Or, or maybe Here not. it is. Have you found it at last? Ah, uh, yeah, sure. It certainly took you long enough. I hope you didn't leave a mess. Me? No way! Yeah, exactly. But enough chit-chat. Bozo's waiting! Just relax, Rufus. It's not like anything's on fire. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. Well, see you later. Seymour! The house is on oh, fire! Okay. What's that funky smell? Yeesh! Rufus, have you gone completely <laughs> off the deep end? You almost set Grandma Utz's heart on fire. All for I don't know what you're about. You committing suicide? No, I'm traveling to Elysium. But Rufus, we've been through all that. I thought you would finally become reasonable. I don't know what become you mean. Become reasonable? I am reasonable. And that's exactly Look at this why perfectly my plan machine. is going to work this time. What, what could possibly talking? go wrong? Well, what does it look like? It looks like a madman's attempt to refute the principle of action and reaction. What Close do you mean? enough. Goodness gracious me. As soon as I step on these bellows, the cork will hit the three targets one by one. In a spectacular chain reaction, this will cause the rockets to be lit and the safety rope to be cut. I have calculated everything. Just watch and learn. Oh, and keep away from the falling blade if you want to hold on to your fingers. Yeah, exactly. See, the bellows will, of course, um, see, it'll, it'll, um, create internal pressure within this pipe, which will then shoot the cork out onto this. Uh, you know, and then it'll, you know, choo choo you know, this'll, this'll knock this, uh, vase over, of course, um, which, and this will burn. The, uh, the, um, how the heck is this supposed to, uh, the, uh, in this, um, the, the, um, uh, the, uh, the rope, of course, will end up being the, uh, anyways, onward! No, Rufus, no! <laughs> now I see the, uh, see? Oh, jeez. Ah, uh-oh. Doc! That's not a good place for a nap. The Bunsen burner could boil away the water in the vase any minute. And when the scales pan goes up, it will trigger the guillotine. The fuse is already lit. Doc, are you listening? Wake up! Oh, what a Sheesh. Bummer. Save Doc or go to Elysium. Save Doc or go to Elysium. Darn it. What do I do? What do I do? What do I that do? That is a difficult choice. 
Sheesh. Doc. Doc, are you listening? Doc, wake, wake up already. Oh, what a bummer. Didn't even hit your good eye, pal. Come on. Nope, my breath isn't enough to blow the gas into the flame. Too bad. That would be a cool party trick. Oh, you know what? Huh. The gas from the bottle is being blown toward the flames. Unfortunately, yeah. it isn't enough to light the gas. Too bad. Well, that would be a cool party trick. That would be a cool party trick. And whoop. Woof. Perfect body control, as always. Well, I suppose we may as well uh, cut the... Uh... Can I throw the knife? <laughs> I could hit that with a well-aimed toss, but that would just trigger the guillotine. And somehow, I doubt that Doc would still be in the mood for thunderous applause. Oh yeah, probably not. In which case, maybe the Very Bunsen clever. burner. I'll simply solve the problem through a process of elimination. Doc will be proud of me. I will eliminate the Bunsen burner. Okay, pal. What else could I cut? Maybe the fireworks? Maybe I can scratch a little black powder out of there. That shouldn't affect the flight characteristics of the saw blade, should it? Probably not. I don't see why not. I don't see why so. <laughs> that tickles. All right, well, cool. With the right momentum, I could catapult the black powder into the air intake of the bellows. And it, of course, and totally realistic. worked perfectly because I'm With such powder I'm so scientifically flames, minded. It could ignite the gas. And then mm, there's bound to be an interesting chain reaction whose outcome is very difficult to predict. What am I waiting for? Yeah, what could possibly go wrong? It, oh, it worked. I saved Doc. We did it, guys. We saved Doc. <laughs> Whoa! And then we made it to Elysium. What the heck? Go. We did it! We're back, baby! What he said. Rufus. Rufus! Yes, yes, what? me. That's me. You haven't answered my question. How what did you, you mean? get here? I just don't understand. That's that's how I got here. That's because there is nothing to understand. Why is he not The whole story not is alive. nothing but one big filthy lie. Almost as filthy as Rufus, but not quite. Hey, you take that back. Of course it's Cletus. Why would that surprise you? I am not the one who barged in here uninvited. I have come to save my planet. Well done, moron. Goal and I had reached an agreement. What? I was trying to keep the existence of the Deponians a secret from the Council of Elders, so that Deponia could be exploded, but Goal convinced me to tell the truth. Really? We're just about to save Deponia. The escape ah. pod was taking us to Elysium. Ah. Now, well. it's useless. We're not going to make it to Elysium, and the Council of Elders will never learn about the Deponians. Bravo, Rufus. That was a stroke of genius. Why, thank you. I'm don't sure glad you've noticed. Goal. He's lying through his teeth. I don't know. His version does sound pretty convincing. Oh. Remember, oh. he's lied to you before. The yeah, and I, I know, definitely have never it. never have let him get away with it. That's because you only know one part of goal. The part that is naive and idealistic. Mm. The goal that I know is a fighter who will stand up for what she believes in. But there is a third part. Yeah, she did well. beat my socks off. And that off. part sides with me. Isn't that true, Goal? There is no third part. You tell him, Goal. I... I just don't know. I, I can't remember a thing. Of course you can't. Thanks to this flea bag's brilliant intervention, your brain implant has been damaged. That's a habit of his. I I'll fix it. Don't worry. That's you just not the case at all. It, do you? We have no use for you here. If you really want to help Gold, then jump. 
We're what? directly over the ocean. With a little luck, you may even survive the fall. Yeah, not no. from this kind of height. No, this isn't right! Oh, come on. Do what is best for goal. Oh, I'll do what's best for goal, all right. I'm what's best for goal! Watch out! No, don't! Ha! Huh, nothing. Why? I wonder if... Uh-oh! No! Goal! What? You idiot! No, goal! Goal! No, 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 no! You blasted idiot! Cletus, help me! Hang on! Don't panic! I'll come and get you! Somehow! Do you finally realize the damage you're doing? I don't know what you're talking about. Don't panic! I'll get you! Why don't I do everyone a favor and kill you right here? I'm coming, Gaul! Hang in there! Where do you think you're going? I'm on my way! Watch out! The rope's going to break at any moment! What? what are you doing? Did you really think you could get away like that? Say bye-bye, Rufus. Cletus! No! Cletus! Cletus, no! Uh, ah! Jeez, Cletus, what the heck? Oh dear, what have I done? Haven't I spent enough time... ...falling from dangerous heights? Sheesh. Cletus, what I the heck? I still can't believe he really did that. No you can't? No need to worry, really. He's just like a wombat. He often falls, but he always lands on all, uh... Um, all the others. <laughs> I know. What is that noise? <laughs> what the goal? Ah, uh, don't be silly. If that were goal, the next we could expect. Well, Rufus. Huh. Rufus. Rufus. Ouch. Well. My genius plan has in fact come to fruition. This is uh this is um what we uh this is uh we um what I uh what I wanted all along. Acknowledge Chief Blaster. Yeesh. Anything else? Are there no new instructions? We can start the countdown now. I appreciate your eagerness, but this is not a training maneuver. Hum. This does not look this good. This is about destroying the zone around the Rust Red Sea. Before we blow up the entire planet. I see oh, it. well. Stop interrupting me. I know very well what is at stake here. Do you think I wasn't aware of all the implications? It is true. Inspector Cletus has not yet reached Elysium. You um. can only guess what kept him. But as long as there is still hope that he will complete his task, we need not worry. Until then, I don't want to hear about any countdowns. Do you understand? Yes, I do, Bailey. Cletus is going to succeed. But of course. He will convince the Council of Elders that there is no sentient life on Deponia. Uh, and if uh. he should fail, then we shall see to it that the planet is indeed uninhabited. Um, dismissed. That I does have not too many sound worries of my own great. to deal with your moral misgivings. So get out! Out, I say! Yeah, yes, sir. Um, Where the that's devil no is good. This? Oh, I think I found him. God, there's a lot of cutscenes in this game. Okay. There's a lot of cutscenes in this game. Only the most epic tales feature cool depictions of your saw blades crushed into cable boat walls. The yeah, what stunt. he said. The fact that goats and plant which surely can't be blamed on Rufus at all. No, no. Reckoning no, no. at all. The best was yet to come. For the end of part one seemed a little too coarse. And yeah, I, I, I... Them to attend a second chance for a decent happy end in a grand fling. He's dancing in boots. And so forth. Yeah, exactly. Ah, That's a, a, yeah. Um, with a you know. Anyways. And here I was talking about visual novel games. Isn't that a riot? Yeesh. Well, back on Deponia, I guess. Oh. 
How many times have I almost made it to Luizium so far? I think I ought to fire my chiropractor. Doc? Huh. Well, I guess we you fired him. Docked. Huh. Where is everybody? Huh. A note from Bozo, that old pirate. Yeah. Shh, this game Good is all cutscenes. Lazy bones. Doc it's still morning? Wow. To his office. Huh. Huh. Finally, someone who uses his brain. She wasn't feeling all that well. Yada no, yada yada. No. Blood from her ears. Blah oh, blah blah. That's, uh, you can find me in a tavern. Tavern? Now that sounds promising. Huh. Finally, I'll leave. Don't forget to go and see Doc. He needs your help. Oh. <sighs> well. Why can't they ever manage without me? Anyways, they can wait a week. Sheesh. Till then, like, comment, and subscribe, or I will toss you from a great height. Ha 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 ha. Goodbye! Yeah, I hope that one. I thought it was pretty funny.